A policy related to health disparities of STDs in African-American women is Title V funding of abstinence-only sex education and the Patient Protection and Affordable Care Act. Considering early onset of sexual activity is a primary risk behavior that leads to other risk behaviors, sexual education in schools is an appropriate intervention. While comprehensive sex education could be an effective intervention to target the population, it is absent in most schools. Only 22 states mandate sex education, and of some of those that do, the information provided does not have to be medically accurate or culturally appropriate. The program is targeted at youth and adolescents, and its goal is to teach abstinence only until marriage as the only method of preventing STDs. But it's not mandated in all states, and because of this, it does not reach the population that it needs to. The policy has been tested, and research shows that it's ineffective in STD prevention. This concludes my project. Thank you very much for watching.